Hi everybody, it's Lisa. Joyfully Art, welcome back to my channel. Um, last week, I wasn't talking during my video. I was very, um, had a very bad cold. We went camping over, I started getting it last week. We went camping over Memorial Weekend and that just kind of aggravated it even more. It was very cold and wet and rainy and all kinds of ick. So that didn't help it any. So I just didn't feel like talking last week and just had music going. Um, and I forgot to the last, last week and this week. I forgot to bring the dried results of my painting from last week. I'm getting ready to do a show on Sunday, which will be June 6th. So I'm getting everything ready and everything's just kind of everywhere right now. So that's why I don't have my paintings right here on hand. So I'll get them together and show them to you at a later date. I'm sorry about that. So for right now, I just have this small eight by 10 that I'm gonna be working on today. I have this beautiful Naples yellow that I added some deco art um, yellow iron oxide to that I'm gonna use as a base coat. I think it's made a very pretty yellow. And it just has a mound on a mound and then it disappears. So I'm gonna be putting that down as my base coat. And see how beautiful it is. Very bright, pretty color for spring. <clears throat> We'll just put that back there, out of the way. Let's get my sides all covered. I was so disappointed. I was so looking forward. It, Memorial Day is usually our first um, camping weekend for the year. So looking forward to it. Oh, and it was such a miserable time. It was so cold and and rainy. Um. We got there Friday, late Friday afternoon, and couldn't even sit outside. It was so cold and miserable. Saturday was a little bit better. Sunday was okay. But we came home Monday, and I slept all the way home come home and put on sweatpants and a long sleeve shirt and wrapped up in my blanket on the couch and slept the rest of the day, the rest of the evening and all night long. I really didn't feel good. But the great husband that I have brought everything in from the camper, put it all away and then went out and did walk, yard work on top of everything else, so. I got a great one. Let's see, I've got something in my paints. Let me get it out oh, before I can't see it anymore. Make sure we don't have any other goobers going on here. <clears throat> Make sure I got my sides good and covered. Check the back here. Maybe run a little bit of this off. I think I got quite a bit of paint for my base coat. But you never know if you're gonna need it or not. So I think I'll just leave what I've got in case I want it for something. I think it's looking pretty darn good. <clears throat> Can still hear my voice. I'm <clears throat> still kind of hoarse and I still got a cough, but it hangs on, that's for sure. Get my hands wiped off. I'm going to give it a 
torch because I just mixed these colors together. Air bubbles going on. Don't want any of that. I don't know what this is. If I can find it now. good. Now I think this is Deco Art Primary Magenta. I haven't used my bottle paints for a while, so I might have some um, goobers in them. I'm not sure. Um, let's go up that way. I am going to use my little blower <clears throat> and I've got some attachments that I'm going to use. <clears throat> Excuse me. Should have shook my paints beforehand. Um, folk art, light lavender. See something coming out of there already that I don't want in my paint. Go. Got that out of there in time. And there we go. It is off. It's all over the place. It's on me, huh? This one is Art Mines. Chili powder. Oh, that one sprayed everywhere. My dog sat down here. I hope it didn't get on her. <laughs> this is Deco Art Primary Yellow. For a little contrast, I've got um, Latex Basics, Payne's Gray. Actually, I think I'm going to put some of this magenta on top because it kind of got lost in there. And I think the lavender did too, so we're going to put a little bit more of that. Okay, <clears throat> excuse me, now we're going to blow it out, I'm not blow it out, I'm going to give it a, one more torch on here, then we're going to blow it out. I have these three attachments that I bought for the little blower. So first off, I think I'll try the biggest one and see how that works. So all you have to do is just turn this down, turn this and take it off. And then you do the same. You just put that on and then turn it so it doesn't come back off. And we're gonna try, start down here and try and blow this out. And it is working pretty well. How about that?
pretty. Really pretty. Pour some of this back. Oh my goodness. I really like that. This works really well. I'm really happy with the way this, really, really happy with the way this works. Very pleased with the way that worked. Oh, that's so pretty. Very happy with this. Wipe off the edges here. Give it a turn so I can get all the edges wiped off good. Make sure I got all my all my sides covered. One more flip around, I think. Whoop. I hit my finger on that as I was bringing it around. Yep, Barry did it again. The glove is coming off. I keep hitting that. Man, that's pretty. All right. I don't think I'm gonna mess with it anymore. I really like it like that. There's a little piece right here. Let's see if I can blow that out just a little bit more. It's a very small one. Let's see if that will work. I can't ever find my button. There we go. That works better for the type for the closed in close pieces. Can't talk for the closed pieces places pieces. Oh my goodness. more of the color to come out. All right, whoops, that fell off, didn't it? Well, I'm gonna put the other one back on anyway, so that's good. Must not have had it on there tight. All right, that's it. Love it. Love it. Okay, folks, that's it for today. I said I'm gonna be at a show um, Sunday the 6th, it's called Barn at Bridge Out, so if you're in Illinois, look it up, would love to see, 
some people there. It's supposed to be nice this weekend, so that'll be a plus. It's from 11 till 4. She has a, um, a Facebook page, so just look at Barn at Bridge Out, and you will find it. Be nice for a nice weekend outing, a nice Sunday outing for you. You give it one more torch just to make sure we have no air bubbles. I've been doing paint, paint pouring for quite a while now, and I don't have that many subscribers, but I'm still hanging in there, hoping that I'll get some more. So. If you feel like it, please share with your family and friends or whoever you think would enjoy this. And um, tell your friends to subscribe. Isn't that gorgeous? All my information will be down in the drop boxes. Drop box if you want to get a hold of me. Leave me a comment if you'd like. And that'll be it for today. So please, everyone, have a great day.